Hey guys, welcome back. So, it has definitely been, I want to say, a little bit more than a week or so. I don't remember when's the last time I made a video, but here I am making a new one for you guys and to catch you guys up and on what's been going on for the past week or so because I've been super busy with everything and um, I just have so much good news for you guys so um, right now I came to throw out the trash but I was like you know what I'm gonna just start my video I'm all excited and stuff so I am gonna be catching you guys up on a lot of things well not a lot but a good amount of things that have been going on so let's get to it So, I'm going to talk to you guys while I get um, me and Gabriel some water with ice. But, I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about what's been going on. So, um, actually when I last posted, um, I was telling you guys that I was studying for my permit, which I did. And then... Um, I ended up taking my test on Friday. No, Thursday. I took it Thursday. Was it Friday? I don't even remember. It was th it was definitely Thursday or Friday. I took my written test and I went with confidence and everything and I failed my test. I missed seven questions. Um, I wasn't quite sure how many I was able to miss because on the computer it doesn't tell me. So I took my test. I missed seven questions. So took it again on Monday. Well, the thing was I was going to take it on Monday, but it ended up being closed, so I had to go back Tuesday. So Tuesday, I took my test and I passed, so I now have my permit, so exciting. So now I could finally learn how to drive and stuff. So I did that and then, so I've actually been driving a lot more since I, uh, got my permit, which I'm learning actually. I already drove on the streets and everything and on the freeway, so I'm I'm learning. So then um, that was one thing. So that is one news. Let me take these waters up and then I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. All right, so I am in my room where I have my desk and everything. So I told you guys one thing. Now, I don't know if you guys, I'm pretty sure it was so noticeable and I'm doing it on purpose. But another announcement is that me and Gabriel decided to get promise rings. So, and I'm like super happy about it because, well, so we had gotten them, um, a couple of days ago probably probably a week ago and we had said that we weren't gonna wear them until um our anniversary came which was monday so that's another thing i'll um talk to you guys about so um yeah we got promise rings this is my ring it has like little sparkles like little diamonds off to the side just to like right here but hold on let me flip it and i'll show you guys better this is how it looks. I don't know why I'm doing it like that. This is how the ring looks. It's actually super pretty. And then um, Gabriel's ring is all black. It's it's pretty thick, but it's all black with, I want to say, a matte finish. I don't know. I don't know. It's all black, though. But yeah, we, are, we were super happy to get those. So uh, yeah, we got promise rings. And... Um, Monday we turned six years, so we obviously went on a whole date and everything. So, um, actually Monday, that was the day I was supposed to go take my test again. Now I know that was Martin Luther King Jr.'s birthday, but, um, or the holiday, so we were supposed to go to the DMV that day, and I checked the hours and stuff, and it didn't say it was going to be closed, which I should have... I should have figured it was going to be closed, but it just said hours might differ, so uh, we went anyways, and I was getting all pumped and stuff. I'm like, yeah, like, I got this, right? Like, I'm going to do my test and everything, but no, it was empty, so it was, like, closed, closed, so I was like, you know what? It's fine. I, it gives me an extra day to study, and that's what Gabriel told me, too, so I'm like, okay, that's, yeah, fine, that's fine, so then Tuesday, that was the day. Tuesday, we went, and then... um. 
I was pumped again and we went and it took us forever because there was a really big line that day. Um, we didn't go early enough either. It was like 10 or 11. So we were there for at least two hours maybe. An hour probably. Hour and a half. And I took my test and everything. And it doesn't tell you how many you're missing as you go. So like I was keeping track like this with my hand. So um, I only missed three questions. I don't know how many questions I got because it didn't, it doesn't tell you. It just it doesn't have like question one or two. It was just blank with the questions. So, um, I missed three questions and I passed. I will, I'll put the little picture cause I took a screen. I took a, um, picture of this, the computer screen where it says, congratulations, you passed this test. So I'll put it right here. And then um, I passed and everything, so it was super exciting to tell everyone that I did my, I passed my permit test and stuff. So yeah, I got my permit. And then right away that day, Gabriel starts saying like, okay, like we're going to go take you driving and stuff. So we did, and I actually drove on the streets for the first time, like on the actual streets not like in the neighborhood and stuff. So it was really exciting and I was like so scared to do it, but I did it and I got used to it. Well, and there's still a bunch of things I need to like figure out and actually do right. So um, I'm learning, it's a process, but that happened. So back to Monday. Monday, we were gonna have a whole date and everything. So we woke up early and we headed to the DMV, found out it was closed, and then we went to his brother's and sister's house to tell them that we got our promise rings because uh, we weren't gonna wear these until Monday. So um, we went to go tell them and we weren't originally gonna go have breakfast, but then we decided, why don't we just go to Denny's? But then Denny's was like super packed and then we didn't have an extra mask so we had to go back to their house to get one because they lived like right there so um then we decided to eat somewhere else and we ended up going to Spencer's Cafe I think that's what it's called um it's right there on White Lane behind McDonald's around there so but close to the DMV so then um we went to eat at Spencer's for breakfast and it was super good that was the first time there and I I highly recommend like it was really good I got biscuits and gravy and he got um I don't know what he got but it had ham eggs bacon no sausage and stuff like that so and pancakes Ooh, the pancakes were really good and the hot chocolate anyways so we went there and then we needed to kill time from there. It was already like 11 or 12. And to the time we were going to be going to Olive Garden later on. So we ended up going to my grandma's house to kill some time. We told her about our rings and everything. And she got emotional and stuff. But it was it was fine. It was, it was nice to tell them. And then uh, we waited there for like two hours maybe. And then afterwards we left, we left grandma's house and then um, we kind of just killed time for a while. And then I had wanted to do my nails because I wanted my nails ready for when I was going to be showing you guys my ring like here, but it didn't happen. I couldn't find a place or I probably just didn't want to. So um, we killed time. We went, what did we do in that time? I don't know what we did. I think we went back to his sister's house and then, oh yeah, yeah, we went back to the sister's house and then we ended up playing Monopoly for a while and we left around four something to Olive Garden and we ate and he, um, we love Olive Garden. Like we, we always go there for our dates. So well, not always, but for like our anniversary dates. So we went to Olive Garden. We, we were there for what, like an hour and a half maybe or two hours and then um, at like 7, we were going to go to the movies to go watch Sing 2. Recommend it. It's really, it's really cute. So then we went to the, after we ate, we went to the movies. And it was already like 7 around there. And no, it was like 6, 640 or something like that. Because the movie started at 720. So we ended up buying our tickets over there and then we went to Vaughn's and Rite Aid around there. And um, it was 
it was actually fun you know it was a super simple day but that's normally what we do we have breakfast if we do and we'll go have dinner and then we'll go watch a movie but yeah that was really nice and just super simple to celebrate our six years which was really nice and then tuesday what happened tuesday what did happen tuesday oh we went back to his sister's house and i drove a lot that day too i actually drove at night with traffic so i was a little scared but i got it Oh, yesterday I needed to go to our college to get um, my book for my English class because school started. That's another thing. School started on the 15th, which I've been kind of going crazy just organizing everything, trying to get myself in a, on a schedule so I can have everything. Actually, I have my planner out and everything so I can... Um, and I couldn't get my homework done until I had my book, so I have it. It's actually on the bed, like right there. So um, I need to do some homework too. It's not due till the 25th, but might as well get it over with. So uh, that happened. It's been super stressful for school because um, I got one class and Gabriel got another class and then so we both have two classes but our other class we got that one together so uh, something happened with our professor that he he or she couldn't do it online so um, we're gonna have like a little late start so that's pretty stressful too because you don't know when you're gonna start your class so yeah we're focused on school right now trying to be focused a lot more and also um, Two of our goats, or the moms, they had their babies. They were pregnant. Uh, we have more babies, more goat babies. Um, so the first mom, she gave birth on our anniversary. So uh, she had two babies. She had two boys. And then on the 18th, the other mom gave birth to two girls. But it was a little bit sad because she, um, she doesn't... Is, she's not feeding her uh, one of her babies like the other one she feeds it really well and everything but the other one she just doesn't like recognize that it's hers so she kind of like pushes her and stuff so like she does so we have to bottle feed her and force the mom to give uh, milk so we kind of just hold her and put the baby to feed because she needs she needs her nutrition, like, you know, the milk that her mom has. So we get we feed her with the mom whenever we can, and we also feed her with the bottle. So she's, kind of, she's like, super cute and tiny, but like she's really skinny because she needs more food and stuff. So uh, she's getting there. She's um, really healthy, and I'll put a picture right here of her. She's, like, super cute. And I feel like that is everything. I needed to catch you guys up on actually today um for now we're still at home because at like three or something we're gonna feed the baby again i will show you guys that just because she's super adorable and then at like five or six we're gonna go to my grandma's because it's my grandpa's birthday today so we're gonna go have a little dinner for him and cake and stuff. Actually, I'm gonna make him a cake. So um, after we feed the baby, we're gonna go to his sister's house so we can do some homework, some more homework. And then I left, I have this box thing full of my uh, stuff for, <laughs> a truck just passed by with the dog in the back seat. It was cute. Anyways, um, I have my stuff for baking, like all my tools and everything that I need for like writing and stuff. So we're going to go over there. I'm going to make the cake there. And then we'll be going to grandma's and visit for a while for his birthday. And I'm pretty sure some of my tia is going to go, my mom. I think that's about it. And just us. So, um... Right now, I am actually going to do a little bit of homework, so I will see you guys in a little bit. So, it is a couple hours since I last recorded. It is 3.33 and we are gonna uh, feed the baby already. So, I will show you guys. So, we have her little bottle right here. So, this is our little, little baby that, that needs to be bottle fed. Here she is. She's so cute. Look at her.
it is now the next day it is 1 19 and yesterday we our plan didn't actually end up happening on going to his sister's house doing the cake and stuff so uh we got caught up doing things here at the house at like to like five something so I didn't have time to actually make a cake for my grandpa so we had to go buy one which was okay because you know we st we said we we're gonna get him one so we did and um we bought like it looks like a mud pie or something like an ice cream one and then we got like a, the mini thing of cupcakes of red velvet so we took that and we spent some time there with my family, it was nice, and we stayed there for a little bit because we still had to come home early to come feed the baby again. So we left at like 8 something, and um, we fed her once we got home and everything. And then after that, um, we just stayed... We just stayed home and stuff because it was like 9 already, but we had planned that at like... 10 or 11 we we're gonna go check on her again just to be sure um so we did and she was fine so um yeah that was the end of our night and i didn't record anymore just because um i was gonna drive to my grandma so i couldn't record or anything which was okay but yeah that was the end of our day and i think i'm gonna close out um the video right here so um it was nice talking to you guys. I really wanted to catch you guys up on everything that's been going on. And I did. So, yeah. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.